Hi everyone, this is the Palomar knot. It's been widely broadcast. This, this is my version, hopefully a little bit more colourful than some of the others. And we'll have a chat during it too, I think. It's just so simple, you don't have to think about it too much. Just loop your line, double it. Don't loop it, double it. Then pass it through the eye of the hook. The lure of the swivel, showing a hook in this case. Now lay the tag end across the main line and then make one wrap or overhand knot through the loop. Do it the same as it's shown here in the picture, much easier. Now just, it's nearly finished, just pass the loop over the hook, in this case, or the lure or the swivel. And then Grab the tag and the line and just gently pull it till everything fits together. If it's monofilament or fluorocarbon, you may need a bit of spit, but if it's just braid, just give it a pull, trim off the end. Here I am showing you how to do it. Now I am in my 60s. My hands are a bit achy. My eyes are a crook. Um, I'm doing my best here. so. I think it went okay for an old fella. You youngies out there, which most of you are, I'm sure you'll find it so much easier than this. See how easy that was? It just takes a couple of seconds, but I wouldn't want to be blindfolded. But a super strong knot, there's two lines going through the eye of the hook. Really easy. Different lines are more difficult, depends on whether it's braid, monofilament or fluorocarbon. In this case, it was a piece of, I think, fluorocarbon. I can't remember. It's not written on the actual, on the actual um, spool of line that I used. Now here, we're moving on now to the double Palomar knot. Really, it's exactly the same knot, except you're running the line around that loop twice. So, same again, pass it the the uh, line through the eye of the hook in a doubled form, lure or swivel. And then we're doing exactly the same thing again, laying the tag end across the main line and make one wrap through the loop. Now we're moving to the next stage. This is the difference. We're wrapping it one more time. So you've gone through that loop and then you've gone through that loop again. Now you pass the loop over the hook, lure or swivel, exactly as what we did before, lure, hook or swivel. We're doing a hook in this case. Moving to the right here, you're pulling the tag line as we did before, the tag and line in gently to tighten. Now this, there's a lot more line here to pull on and a lot more tangle. So don't tangle, please. Just do it gently, make sure everything works. Different lines, different. Pull the knot, trim it. Now I'm about to show you my shaky old 65 year old hands. I said five, I'm not quite there yet, so, um, but close. So as you can see, I'm not that young. Got it through, can't see what I'm doing, but I'm doing it by feel. If you wanna do another knot that's really easy, super strong, on my channel, my fishing channel, it is really so simple. Sim fishing OBS channel. And it's my first knot that I've ever published. And I can do it actually with my eyes closed. This one's a great knot, probably stronger. And I think the other one is better personally because my father showed it to me and I don't know who else knows it. So check it out, please. Thank you and enjoy yourself.